Actually, I was a student here uh, when my, in my last rotation of my undergrad, and uh, my final placement was in the emergency department. And so when I did it, I loved the people I worked with. Uh, and so when I was offered the position, I was happy, you know, I was really happy to take it. So initially, I always thought, you know, pediatrics was sort of my my uh, passion. But having done pediatrics, I realized I'm actually a very, uh, you know, a fast learner. I love working in fast-paced environments, really quick on my feet. And so when I just thought, let me give emergency a shot and see how it goes, I really felt like I found my niche. The way I ensure that their visit is good is forming a baseline. And then from there, trying to meet all their expectations or the needs that, are, that were missed. And so when we meet them, they're more content with the care that was provided. And we're all pretty happy and I'm happy that I was able to provide that care for them. I think I've always had positive feedback from every patient of mine. Just having that person sit there in that room longer, sit through all the concerns, it's no more that walk-in uh, uh, philosophy of one concern per visit. They are really literacy, you know, literally discussing everything with me from uh, a head-to-toe assessment to any social supports that they're not having in the home. So the feedback I've received has been very positive from families. So when I was in registered nurse, we didn't necessarily do telephone follow-ups. So when I became a nurse practitioner, what was new to me at least was um, doing telephone follow-ups. So there was one day um, I had made a phone call over and uh, the elderly patient on the other side uh, who was speaking with me really brought up the concern that he was really depressed and that he wanted to take his life. Um, and, and so then I had to call in the wife to, and speak with the entire family to ensure that you know, he's either brought to the emergency department and I'll stay longer if I have to, or that we make sure that there, he won't commit any um, actions to his plan. And so his wife um, said they lived really far, they can't come to the emergency department, being our hospital or any other closer um, hospitals. And so I said, you know, I'm really concerned, you really need to bring him in. So she did bring him in, I did stay longer, um, and we did admit him and get the help that he needed. Personally, it really stayed with me, this, that story, primarily because they say, um, uh, at least in, there's a saying that if you save you know, a person's life, it's like you saved all of mankind. I love cake decorating, which is really, uh, I guess, different whenever I say to people. Um, really involved in sports. So flag football has always been my sort of forte in, uh, in, uh, throughout high school and I've continued with just friends. Um, and other than that, I love traveling. So I uh, just came back from Wales, England, horseback riding, so that was nice. And uh, yeah, 